okay guys so let's get started uh, I don't need this device so let me minimize this and also let me delete this app from this application from this device okay guys so let's create new new project working with runtime permissions click next and select any api level and empty activity click next and click finish so our application is ready and since i want to check the connectivity uh, uh sorry i want to check the permission uh, by on button click so let's create a button so here we are let's remove this text view and create a button match parent web content text check permission in id check permission find this id here in check permission now we have to type cast it btn check permission is equal to button find you by id or id dot check permission and now uh, assign the on click listener btn check sorry btn check permission dot set on click listener so here we set the on click listener and now when the button is clicked we have to check the permission so how you can check the permission there is a method activity compat and the method is check self permission it requires two parameters the first one is context main activity dot this and the second one is the uh, string permission so you have to provide the permission that which permission you need and yeah, I want to work with the right external storage if it is not equal to package manager dot permission granted so what this sentence means here we have a, a method with the name of check self permission and this checks the permission whether the permission is granted or not Manifest dot permission dot extra right external storage which permission this one for right external storage permission if it is not equal to package manager dot permission granted so it means that this condition means that the permission is not granted so what we have to do we have to request permission so how you can uh, request the permission activity compat dot you have a method request permission so the first parameter we have to pass the main activity dot this and the next we have to provide the permissions of string array so manifest dot permission dot write external storage and also we have to provide request code external storage request code so I don't have this request code so I have to create this private static final end is equal to 100 you can write anything you can give any uh, number here this gives us some error so write new and now it's done okay so this means that the permission is not granted so we asked for permission and in the else section we write here permission is granted do your work this means that this sentence will uh, means that the permission is not granted and in the else section means that the permission is granted so we can perform our, our work here so for that purpose i want to create a method here public wide mm, proceed after permission so here i want to show a toast 
permission is granted body so I will call this method here proceed after permission now this uh, request permission will show a dialog to the user where he she can allow or deny the permission and how to handle that permission for that purpose we call another method on um, on permission on request permission result so this is the method that we have to handle as well and this method provides us with the result of the permission whether the user has allowed the permission or not so how we can check that if request code is equal to external storage request so if the request code equals to this then we can check if result if grant results dot length is greater than zero which means that it contains the user's uh, decision and grant results zero we have is equal equal to package package manager dot permission granted so again we can call this method proceed after permission and in the else section we can show a toast in which we can say enable unable to get permission so our app is ready and let's run our application but one thing we have forgotten and that is we have to provide the permission in the manifest so uses permission uh, right external storage and that's it so our application is launched and let's check permission and this is our runtime permission allow working with runtime permission which is the name of our application to access photos media and files on your uh, device now if i click allow permission is granted buddy and now let's go to the settings and check it out settings apps working with runtime permissions and check out this permission so here we have runtime permissions now if I revoke the permission from here or let's delete this app uninstall okay uninstall finished and let's run this app again now the app is launched so let's check for permission you can see that uh, now again the, per, uh, the permission is asked to the, so that you can allow or deny now if the user gets confused of what this is and he she clicks the deny button so here you can see that unable to get permission and again you can see and if she uh, he she again clicks deny so unable to get permission now if you want to explain your permission using uh, other dialogue so you can do that uh, do that as well and how we can do that inshallah we will do that in the next video so see you in the next video stay tuned